Hi, I'm Vince Weston, and this time I'm going to show you uh, what I picked up uh, in the previous week at the Hobby Lobby 40% off sale on model kits. I stormed in there twice into two different two of the stores that are in my area, and these are the things I picked up. Uh, mostly the, I was preparing for the Bandai group builds. There's the first one. Let's see if I can get some of the glare off. Not really, but anyway, it's the B8, BB8, and R2-D2 from Star Wars. Um, I, I've been looking at this one and uh, the, they were running low in my store, so I figured it was a good time to get my hands on it. So I grabbed that bad boy. And what would a Bandai group build be without <laughs> the infamous Gundams? And this time I decided I'd go with some ground stuff. So I picked up the Leo kit, which is the Oz, or you know, I think it's Oz mass produced mobile suit. Looked pretty cool. I like the uh, yellow face mask in it. So that's why I grabbed that one. And I also grabbed this was the last one on the shelf. Uh, that in the store for the Jesta, which is the EFSF Special Operations Mobile Suit. Another probably cool face mask there, yellow. Hopefully it'll be as cool. I kind of like this guy's weapons a little better. I'll probably do this one in one of the next upcoming ones. And not to be outdone, I had to grab a couple of cars too. Well, they're not actually not even cars, but I finally get pulled the trigger on the Ford Bronco. I decided to go with the regular one and not the uh, off-roading version. Um, I had a lot of friends that had these and didn't really do off-road with them, so I figured this would be a good choice. I know it's not an unusual kit. I'm sure everybody's seen it a gazillion times. And then the last one I picked up is the uh, Revell Germany Land Rover Series 3 109, the long base station wagon. I love wagons. Someday I'm gonna really sit down and just like start building wagons one after another. I got tons of them. Uh, but this was one that I found was, and from conversations I've had with a, somebody else that picked one of these up, Jeff Tree, um, it was off to the side on a bottom shelf, kind of out over some of the, it was almost into the, uh, the metal bodied and the, uh, um, snap tights. So, and it, it was the last one, and I, actually I bought this in the first store I, I went, Hobby Lobby, I went into. When I went into the second one, they only had one of them there also. So I was glad, glad to grab that one. Looks like a cool kit. I've seen reviews of it. And it might have a few problems, but it's a heavy box too. So I'm looking forward to that. That should be cool. Maybe I'll have to have a station wagon group build. And uh, actually, th this was the first time I've, I've binged and bought kits in quite a long time. You'll remember the last two I got for Father's Day. I haven't been really buying much. Uh, I'm trying to build some of the 700 or so I already have. I'm trying to hold off for only stuff that I really, really want or really, really need for group builds. Um, there we are. Okay, so thanks for watching. Keep yourself safe out there. 
wear your masks, social distance, and don't sneeze on anybody. Okay, we'll talk to you later. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Thank you for watching Jensen Weston. Models from the Dungeon.